OT equator spherical evolution. Starting from the OT cap sphere, where the top part of the sphere was already missing, the head was further lowered in this project to retain only the part of the equator. Hence the attachment's name, OT equator biologic, where the divergence is used as retention using the Seeger springs. With this method, you achieve a prosthetic bioimplant rehabilitation that allows you to design and build all types of prosthesis. Fixed, combined, mini medio implants, and with OT equator posts also on the roots. The OT equator attachments are built for all types of implants in use in the world. By taking advantage of the characteristics of the equator sphere and combining them with the use of the Seeger springs, a new technique of complete biological implant prosthesis was born. To order the OT equator biologic attachment, please specify the following with the utmost precision. type and brand of the implant, diameter of the implant, height of the healing gingival rim. Prosthetic Implant Rehabilitation The titanium OT equator biologic attachment is a transmucosal support that is mounted and screwed onto the head of the implant, always during surgical procedure in place of the healing screws and is never taken out again. The soft gum tissue adheres to the transmucosal titanium attachment during healing, forming a barrier that will avoid or limit the risk of peri-implantitis in the future. The external platform of the equator becomes the support of the prosthesis and connects to the sphere of the attachment. It has a threaded closed bottom hole on its head and does not communicate with the interior of the implant that will remain completely isolated from the outside in the future. The OT equator technique in fixed Seeger bridge prosthesis simplifies and solves many problems. The divergence of the implants is transformed from a problem to an advantage. During the insertion of the prosthesis, the divergences are taken advantage of and interlocking connections are created. In many cases, the Seeger spring alone without the support of a screw is enough to fix the prosthesis to the implants, with practical and aesthetic advantages. When working with a dual structure combined prosthesis, the divergence of the implants is always overcome by the mesostructure and fixed in the patient's mouth in a practical and passive way. These results obtained in over eight years of research are a completely new, although easy to learn technique. The surgeon and the dentist continue to use their usual implants without having to invest in any new equipment except for buying a new manual screwdriver to always be used during any prosthetic and surgical procedures. The dental technician will be able to build prosthesis to perfection with normal laboratory equipment as well as using their preferred techniques. Lost wax casting, CAD-CAM milling, carbon fiber or any other technique.